General Hospital scholar predict that Chiat's writer will once again push the plot to a climax. Many speculations say that Esme is likely to lose her baby, which proves that Esme and Willowtay's two babies will only have one of them born healthy. Not long ago, Michael Carando and Willow made a dangerous decision together. They decided to let their baby be born before they were four months old. This seems to be the only way for both Michael and Willow to meet their child. Willow and Michael both know that not only Willow and the baby also face death if the surgery fails. Forcing the baby to be born before a full term is also a risky decision for this young couple. Looks like the surgery went well. Everyone broke down when they saw Willow's child still alive. Michael and Willow are also happy to hear that they have officially become parents. However, at the same time, Esme may also make her birth journey. But for some reason, Esme baby couldn't make it. Esme may not accept the truth because maybe before that, Esme had hoped to see her baby and she wanted to be a mother like any other woman. In another prediction, many people said that after no one everything, he the weapon decided to target Willow's baby. Maybe Heather will carry out a kidnapping of Willow's baby. Heather would likely argue that she wants to redeem herself and make up for the damage Esme has suffered. Heather has also been a mother, so she can understand Esme's feelings of losing her child. Heather will probably kidnap Willow's baby and run away with Esme from a PC town. It seems Heather was thinking of the prospect of living with Esme in the latter days. Willow will soon have her mental breakdown if she receives this information. Is it possible that this psychological shock will affect the disease that Willow is suffering from? Willow could die at any moment. Will Esme accept to raise Willow's child? Will Esme really know that her child no longer exists? Let's wait together for new and exciting details in the next episode.